I'm going to plant some forget-me-nots in this pot and see how it turns out. So right now I'm just getting it ready to put the seeds in. And I got these seeds from Kmart. And here's the package. Get a little bit closer so you can see the entire package. Is it focusing? Let's see. Now we'll open the package up. And we're going to plant those seeds. Make sure we have all the seeds out of the package. And now we'll cover it up with soil and I'll put a little bit of that potting mix on top to just give it a little bit of extra nutrients. I use soil that already had some potting mix, but I'm going to see if I can put some extra nutrients in it. And you'll see that I have the um, plant marker in the back that I showed in a previous video, which is just a cork hot glued to a plastic fork. So you can use it inside or out and it doesn't matter if it gets wet. And for the package, I'm going to take the label off the package, just cut it off so I can make a plant marker so that I'll remember what seeds I planted. Okay, and let me just show you what I did with this. I put it on a cork with a coffee stir stick and it's upside down. Okay, here's a little bit of the flowers. There it is. So forget-me-nots, and this way I put it right into the pot with the seeds. And I'll remember what I planted. Now in the background, I wanted to show you the jute-covered salad dressing bottle. And like I mentioned, in a previous video, I showed you the bottles that were covered with jute that I used regular glue. When I'm using the hot glue gun, I find that it gets a lot of glue all over. So I wanted to test it with something else and it still gets that. But as you see as the bottle in the background, once after a while the jute fibers start to come off and it starts to blend in with the glue so it's not as noticeable. So I start picking some of them off but I realized I was tearing off the jute with it. But then after a while, it just starts to naturally shed some of the jute and it looks better. But just as a tip, I think that if you can avoid using a hot glue gun or use it very carefully, it's for the best. Okay, I hope you like this video. Please subscribe for more. Thanks for